friends, and welcome to Decorate Your Life. Today, I will be showing you how to make your own boutonniere. Some of the items that I'm going to be working with are the following. A rosebud, some baby's breath, a little bit of a filler, uh, leaves, ribbon, floral tape, and some wire. First thing that you're going to do is you're going to cut your rows right about like so and see how your rose is already opened up. What you want to do is you want to take the last petals and just kinda like remove your last petals gently so that you're left here let me this one needs to be removed as well remove your last petals so that you are left with a cute unopened you will notice here that the wire that I'm using is completely different than the first wire that I showed you. And that is because the wire that I had was for jewelry making and it was just too thin. So what I did was I took a large paper clip and I pulled it apart and I attached it to the stem. I had to cut the stem a little bit shorter because it had broken apart on me, but this will work just as well. Now over here, what you see me doing is I am straightening out the paper clip wire so that I may start using the flower tape to wrap it around the flower bud and all the way, I mean, not the flower bud, but to wrap it around the stem. Now take note that every time you add something new, you will keep wrapping it around the stem. So I'm going to go ahead and speed up the video now and you will get a chance to see the entire process in just a moment. Now one thing that I forgot to mention at the beginning of the video is that you're going to need a glue gun. 
basically you're going to need some sort of way to secure your floral tape and to secure your ribbon so if you don't have a glue gun use some dry quick glue i'm sure that will work after all it is only for one evening so um yeah use a glue gun Now, the boutonniere may look ginormous to some, but keep in mind that the camera is right over my hands, and this is how my daughter wanted it. She wanted it to be this size. She wanted it to be uh, this fluffy and this full, so it's what she wants. So I hope you enjoyed this little tutorial, and I'll see you next time. Bye now.